what up what up what's good good people hey hope everybody's doing well uh, i want to come at you today with a little review of beer care products as well as a giveaway but i've been getting some questions about my kind of beard routine kind of what products i use and i've been meaning to get to this for a little while and the one thing i will say my hands down number one product i use probably yeah five out of the seven days and that is rich roots you know beard conditioner conditioning oil all in one all purpose and do i use it you can see that yeah uh, more than halfway gone i actually bought two more of these and this is the actual eight ounce but i got two more because i use it so much now, the reason I use it, and anybody knows anything about me, I'm a family man, Monday through Friday, full-time job, three kids, six, three, and two. I don't have time. I have very little time. <laughs> so, as much as I'd like to get up, shower, and then have the beard conditioning, butters, oils, pick it out and then put the balm you know massage foreplay my beard make love to it I don't have time I need something quick on the go zap get it comb it get out of here that I use for my hair and my beard all in one and if you know anything about my dark sandy brown hair it is some of the driest hair on the face of this earth I mean my hair is dry and um, we talking Steph Curry dry I mean like pound cake we talking uh, value meal double cheeseburger no sauce dry just choke sandwich choke the hell out you that dry and with this it makes it quite okay you know nice shine nice hole at the same time you know soft texture wise easy to comb easy to brush everything I need and I have a lot of other beer care products, but one thing that this wins at, because of course I'm a fragrance guy, the other beer care products are too strong, too overpowering. They basically, they fight and they clash with my fragrances. And I end up being like this referee trying to, you know, control this fight. And it just, it's an, I hate it that way. You know, either I can wear the beer stuff and not fragrance, which that's almost never an option, or I have to find something to complement it, which I don't like doing that either. But with this, it comes on, you put it on, it has this slight eucalyptus, slight tea tree oil, and uh, even a little bubble gummy uh, kind of scent to it. And that just at the beginning. And once it settles in, it has a slight lavender scent to it. But through the entirety, later in the day, after an hour or so, I've been told if you get right up on it and your hair and beard, or you smell a soap. You know what I feel? It's never a bad time to smell like soap. Soap is always a winner. When's it a bad time to smell soapy clean? So, and it's not, like I said, not overpowering, so I'm free to wear whatever fragrance I wanna wear. So, it's just, all in all, it's a win-win. Now, I will say one thing. When you get this, because it is all-in-one, so if you live in a warmer climate and it sits in the mailbox for a while, when you get it, put it in the refrigerator for a little while. Let it solidify. Definitely. And uh, But that's pretty much all it is to it. That is my go-to, my all-in-one. I just I don't have time to do the whole beard thing every single day. I shower, wet it, put that in my hair, on my beard, comb, brush, good to go for the rest of the day. Saves me a lot of time, effort, and I love it. I absolutely love it. And also, yes, if you want to try it out, I have a link below. Click on the link. Uh, you can use the discount code Fragrance Ninja, save you 15%. If you want to try it out, feel free. Now, another part that I want to get into, the giveaway part. 
because on my next review, I will be reviewing Bond number nine, New York Amber. Spoiler alert, it's not for me. And so when it's not for me, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna give it away. And so if you want a shot at this, uh, just comment below on this video. Say, I want in, something like that. And when I do review this, I'll spin a wheel and wherever it lands, that's who's gonna get it. Inside the United States, international shipping, yeah, I keep it in the US. And uh, yeah, I'll definitely give it away. It's a full presentation, got the box and everything. Uh, and if you see, it pretty much is for the most part unused. Just a couple of wearings out of it. It's just, you know, if it's something that's done, really doesn't have a fit in my collection, hey, why not share it with you all? Uh, definitely. But um, really, um, that's all I got. And um, let me know what you think before I base a review. New York, uh, New York, ooh, <laughs> New York Amber. Before I review New York Amber, and like I say, comment below that you want in, and I'll put a name to it, spin a wheel, next review, I'll ship it out. Hey, but that's all I got until next time. Hey, y'all be good.